Showing from Shoshone County. <laughs> <laughs> okay, aren't they cute? Aww. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Good morning and welcome to the first episode of the CDA Idaho show. Uh, it's Wednesday, uh, September 18th, 2019, and uh, we're going to be talking about uh, some upcoming events this week, uh, new products that we've come out with, maybe some food we've had this week. Uh, restaurants to, to pay attention to, things like that. So real quick, before we get started, what are we drinking today? We got, uh, I'm, I'm having a, what is this? <laughs> An Americano from Evans Brothers Coffee, they're just around the corner here. Um, it just says A on it, so it could be. What in the world is that? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, somebody just gave it to me. Uh, this is from Deja Brew. It's a almost gone galaxy smoothie, um, and they can do it with Zip Fizz or Red Bull or anything like that. It's super good. It's colorful. Very colorful, yeah. It's got some tie-dye vibes. <laughs> Can you even see? <laughs> is, that, is that genuine cotton candy inside? Or? No. It does look rough. Can you yeah. tell the folks back home where you got that? I mean, other than where, I mean, it stays on her, but where is it? Yes. Oh, it's between, it's on oh. Ramsey, in between Kathleen <laughs> and Appleway? I think it's like Golf course road. Yeah, we have a cross center. Yeah. yeah, yeah, across from Ramsey Park. It's like so five. visit them. They're super awesome and very helpful. Did you say very healthy? <laughs> no, helpful. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you get zip it, it, like yeah. it might be vitamins. Yeah, right? yeah. yeah. It's definitely good to have. I know it's getting colder, but these are so delicious to have when it's hot outside and when you just want a boost of energy. So and zip is good. Oh, okay. and prevent me from help prevent me from getting sick. Sweet. Um, so today I'm drinking an eight ounce decaf, a white pumpkin latte, um, which is essentially probably like a, a white chocolate latte with pumpkin in it. And I got it from Vaults, just um, on Fourth and Sherman down here, kind of by the office. It's pretty good. Would it be a mocha? A white mocha? I guess it would be. Well, they, there's an L there. <laughs> so it would be a mocha. It would be pumpkin, a mocha. pumpkin white mocha. Pumpkin. A decaf pumpkin. White pumpkin. Pumpkin. White pumpkin. I'm sorry, I didn't want to bring a pumpkin. I'm Unless so the pumpkin was a white pumpkin, not an orange one, in which case there's no white chocolate, and then it would be a latte, right? Unless there was, unless it wasn't white chocolate, unless it was like white coffee or something. Oh. I mean, but I believe it is white chocolate. So you're right, it is a mocha, technically. Okay. Yeah. So this, to sum it up. Look at that blister. Ew. That's from- I'm look, sorry. That's, from, <laughs> hot, that's from hot cooking oil this that's, weekend. That's really? Not that's not to had be huge. <laughs> I've never had a blister. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna, wanna no, up on this. Can this will get me my that. job in National Geographic. Wow. Behind the scenes, enemy lines. Okay. Yeah, enemy okay. lines. And right. I am drinking, and I'm drinking a latte from Evans Brothers. It's delicious. Does it have chocolate in it? No, because then it would be a mocha. mocha. Yes. <laughs> it I was testing you. <laughs> it's been, it's been, yeah. it's oh, a vanilla latte. Thank yeah. you for the clarification. It's a vanilla latte. All right. I think it is. Is that a. Markings of the middle. Look at VL. All right, cool. So we cheers? events. Cheers. Oh, cheers. Okay. Everything. Yeah. Clink, clink. Very good. So here on the show at CDA Idaho Show, we're all about promoting local businesses, not just our own CDA Idaho Clothing Company, but we want you to uh, join us in how you can be learning more about the community events coming up and how you can be supporting local businesses. For those of you that don't know, my name is Andy and I'm the co-owner of CDA Idaho Clothing Company. We're located uh, downtown on the corner of 3rd and Sherman in the Plaza Shops. My name is Nichelle and I am also a co-owner of CDA Idaho Clothing Company. Uh, my name is Jerry and I am the store manager of CDA Idaho Clothing Company. And my name is Brianna and I am head of merchandising at the company. So the two main things that are happening this weekend are going to be Oktoberfest and the Huckleberry Festival. The Oktoberfest is going to be happening all around downtown CDA. Um, it's going to be the 20th and the 21st. It starts at 4 p.m. on Friday the 20th, 
Check-in is at the Plaza Shops downtown, which is right where our shop is. So um, you can buy events online or buy tickets online at Eventbrite or in person. Uh, but just remember, you have to check in at the Plaza. So we'll be there. Um, there's going to be seven live bands, lots of beer and cider. And then on Saturday, it's going to be a bit more family friendly. Kids do get in free if they're under 12 and they do get a complimentary root beer. So that's pretty exciting. So the next event that's happening in downtown is gonna be the Huckleberry Festival. And that's at the Roosevelt Inn, which is located on First and Wallace, just on the corner there. Um, there's gonna be lots of local vendors there. So admission is free and it's from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Great. Cool. Great. Sounds fun. Cool. The, the Roosevelt Inn uh, reminds me, uh, we just did a video, I think uh, we'll, be, we'll be launching it here pretty soon. Michelle and I, uh, on a food tour with Blue Moose Food Tours and TourCDA.com uh, and one of the stops was the Roosevelt Inn. And we got to travel there on Segways. So that was really fun. That was our first cool. experience on Segways. Right. So look for that video. It'll be, we'll be putting it up here very shortly. Yeah. So That was fun. Yeah. And oh. back to the show with the weather. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and Andy, what's for? Actually, I've been out in the weather. I hiked tubs this morning. Yeah. Tubs oh. still. It was beautiful. And a lot of, there were a handful of people out there enjoying it, which was um, fun too, just to see so everybody was so happy and saying hello on the path as they were by. It was kind of, um, kind of like cloudy and gloomy without being cold. It was really mm. nice. All right, so let's begin our segment of what did you eat this week? Whoop. What did you eat this week, Andy? Oh, well, last weekend we went on that Segway food tour in Coeur d'Alene and uh, we went by one of my favorite places right now, uh, Crown and Thistle. Uh, I, my favorite thing there is their bangers and mash. So they, they make their own sausage and then I don't know what the other things are, but they're amazing. And anyways, that's my favorite thing that I've had this week. So. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. How about you guys? Well, you went to Chomper Cafe this morning. I went to Chomper this morning, got their Eggs Benedict, and I think that they have the best Eggs Benedict in town. Now, last week I went to, uh, I think it was last week, yeah, I went to the Vine and Olive, which is mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. Riverstone. Mm -hmm. So, um, <laughs> the, the Vine and Olive is like, they have really good, like, small portions, but they're like, they're so, like, authentic and, like, handcrafted yeah. that they are on the spendier side. So, like, you know, Nick and I went there for our anniversary, so it was like a special occasion. We got, um, we got, like, you know, the, the bread with the balsamic and oil, the Caesar mm -hmm. salad. I want to say we got some, we got the duck, like the, pot, the mm. duck pasta, which was really good. Mm. And then we got short ribs, like yeah. that were, yeah, yeah. With, with pureed turnip. Wow. It's very good. Wow. Uh, good. I didn't know you could make pasta out of duck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But anyways, okay. <laughs> Uh, last week I discovered Terra Coffee bagels are made in-house and with all natural ingredients. Ah, nice. um, and they're super delicious. Uh, I just get a plain cream cheese bagel and it like blows my mind every time. So awesome. That's what Which I- Which one did you go to? Um, the one on North West Boulevard. But they have multiple locations. Go check them out, look them up, go say hi. Okay, so here's our new stickers. Uh, as you can see, we, we have a couple of Coeur d'Alene ones in here, and most of these are PNW. Here's our two new uh, native Idaho stickers, and then PNW, our Coeur d'Alene anchor stickers. This design here was kind of inspired by one of our uh, employees that moved away to, uh, to Hawaii to go to college. Yeah, so yeah, nice shout out shout out to Preston. So uh, it was his idea to do a quarter lane anchor design. So we, we kind of brought this to life in two different variations. Um, here is the sticker I'm really excited about. This has been in my brain for a, a while and we finally brought it to life. I don't know if you remember, babe, like we went to Spokane and did a design session like a year ago. Yeah, I and that. I came up with like a, a, a poor mock-up compared to this, but anyways. Uh, yeah. Congratulations. The Idaho Sweet. rocket ship. Yeah. Because Idaho needs a rocket yeah. ship. Well, my personal favorite is this guy right here. I don't know. I like that one too. Uh, this one's, uh, it's pretty fun because uh, Andy actually sent us two different versions of right. this. And it's fun. We get to kind of put our say in it and, and decide. So this is definitely one that uh, I feel like it's kind of got like a little story behind and everyone was kind of a part of it. So it's, it's a cool design. Action. My favorite is um, the native one. I think this one in particular is my favorite. So we've been asked for a native sticker for a long time. And so it's fun to finally put that out onto a design. And I personally am an Idaho native, born here in Idaho. So that's pretty exciting. 
So for our giveaway, we're gonna be giving away um, to six lucky winners. So we're gonna be choosing two commenters from Facebook, two from Instagram, and two from YouTube. So what you're gonna do to enter is you're just gonna comment on whatever platform you're watching this on, comment um, your favorite sticker, and you can just describe it, whichever one you like, and then two winners will be randomly selected from each platform. And then stay tuned, uh, next week on our next episode, we're going to announce the winners of these stickers. Anyways, thank you guys for watching our first episode of the CDA Idaho show. Stay tuned next week for our second episode. Yes. Be sure to uh, comment your favorite sticker design for a chance to win. Uh, to increase your chances of winning, be sure to comment on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed to us on your YouTube channel, definitely go there, hit subscribe, like this video on whatever platform you're on, uh, and have a great week. Thanks for watching. Bye. See ya. Bye-bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye.